Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I'm back. Thank you so much for your support of my Right Botanicals. Here we plant seeds to help you get your mind right. So let's see who the Holy Spirit wants to use to plant a seed for the collective at this time. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. What is the insight, guidance, and clarity that you have for the collective using a king or queen, zodiac or element? Who we going to use here, Holy Spirit? Y'all, that, that reading I did, that's up before this one. It'll be posted right before this one. That shit was rough. People better be careful out here crying wolf because they don't know who going to answer that call. That's all I'm saying. But moving on, Holy Spirit, which king or queen zodiac or element do you want to use to get out a message? King of Swords. Okay? King of Swords. Air sign, masculine energy, Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra, Holy Spirit. What do we need to know surrounding King of Swords energy from you through me at this time? Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. What do we need to know? There may be a King of Swords. Well, I ain't going I'm, I'm, I just saw retreat and take a break. So either there's a king of swords who wants to retreat and take a break from something or he's been appointed, I just heard, okay, to get someone else to retreat, possibly a Virgo, or take a break, okay? What else, please and thank you, Holy Spirit, do you want us to know surrounding this energy? From you, through me, I'm going to pick it up at this time. Three cards, 5150 DM Intuition. This man was sent in to get you to retreat and take a break, but he feels very conflicted he feel like his mind is fucking with him because he's getting intuitive downloads that he is your divine masculine but he accepted this challenge to get rid of you somehow make you retreat he accepted this challenge from a hierophant group okay this may be confirmation for this King of Swords that whatever you picking up off of this person you were supposed to make take a break, it's true. She got that good, good. She not a bad witch like this hyphen group told you she is, okay? The rumors that have been passed around about this person and you accept it this assignment on false pretenses, but we all make mistakes, okay? So you ain't got to go outside unless you choose to do so. That's what the universe is saying. That's what the Holy Spirit, the Most High God wants you to know. Or you can choose to accept this broken mindset, plan, mentality, effort against this woman. And it ain't going to be the outcome that this hierophant nor you expect. Okay? Because whoever this divine feminine is, her soul is one of a kind. Okay? She got that good, good divine energy that just ain't going to be tampered with and she not gonna be the one that's gonna be in recovery mode okay that's what the most high god trying to tell this king of swords like they may already know what you thinking about doing anyway so you might don't want to need to do that shit and if you feel like this feminine is your sanctuary Okay, if you feel like she is 
your divine feminine, you damn sure don't need to let this hierophant group be with your ass into a jail cell. Because there's some energy like they already be knowing what the plan is, what this hyphen group want this king of swords to do. And he over here like this. I can tell you how I feel about you night and day. So he may have been asking for spiritual guidance. This time he's supposed to have been and damn got taken care of now. His ass ain't been able to do it though because he's, he's still having these very deep feelings for you that just won't go away. They're not allowing his ass to make you retreat. He loves you. He still loves you. So it ain't no telling how long this man was supposed to be doing this to you. But he feels as if you and him share a divine connection and you two have a divine purpose. Y'all must do shit. It's a lot of energy out here that supports his belief. Clarify, Holy Spirit. Merlin energy. This is who you are. He do got a divine connection and divine purpose with this divine feminine merlin energy that this hyphen group paid him to get rid of that to make retreat and he ain't been able to do it and i'm advising that he don't follow through continue to listen to your intuition if you want forgive but don't forget because this group setting your ass up for failure i don't know why i feel like the king of swords gonna hear this Okay, this group set you up for, for, for failure. They sent you to do their dirty work, but it's something like they sent you to do their dirty work because they know who watching this Merlin energy. They, they definitely are doing this to this King of Swords here. He may be realizing that as well, that he's some sort of pawn. Being used as some sort of pawn against this Pisces, possibly. This Merlin energy, okay? You could, She could be a high priestess. If you're listening, you could be a high priestess. But if this King of Swords DM is listening, this is his divine feminine. And he need to retreat from whatever contract he accepted on her because it's a trick of the devil. You better know that. We got They Miss You. I need clarity about that because I just heard whoever sent him towards this Pisces is who misses this Pisces, which is weird as hell. They definitely need healing. Okay. I don't know what that's about. Clarify this. They miss you energy. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Clarify this for the collective and myself. Please and thank you. Ooh, HIPAA violation, civil suit possible, manifest the life that you want. Whoever this is that misses you, they belong to a hyphen group. Y'all gonna stop using these little groups that y'all are part of, pulling them into y'all bullshit, because y'all in y'all feelings. Because these little groups going to start trampling all over y'all damn ass for getting them caught up against divine beings. Because you in your feelings. Whoever this is, this person is part of a group who they have been able to get to fuck with you because this person is upset with how you use some sort of inheritance some sort of abundance you received to manifest the life that you wanted you may have had some sort of civil suit some sort of medical lawsuit or something that you received a payout behind a settlement behind and you took that money and you 
rebuilt your life. You started over. You manifested the life you wanted with what you received. This person is upset about that. They're upset that you achieved this level of success, that you received this abundance, this prosperity, and you were able to make it work for you. And in you doing that, it took you away from this person. They have not been able to have access to you since you took your abundance and you moved forward with your life in another direction. That's why they're mad. And they have actually bewitched a hyphen group against you. Solicit to get so they this is this is what has happened. They have become disgruntled with you, so they convinced the group they belong to to become disgruntled with you as well. In turn, they have hired a king of swords to make you retreat and sit down somewhere. And now this man believes that you are his divine counterpart. That's how to cook it and crumble. That's the trickle down effect here. Okay. And the icing on the, on top of the cake is the fact that these people ain't going to get away with nothing. If this King of Swords comes towards you, he going to get caught up because they watching this Pisces Merlin energy. Okay. Little do this hyphen group and this ex of hers, whoever this person is that was in her past that has rallied these people against her. It may seem like she is out in the middle of a field with no type of protection around her, no type of sanctuary, no type of protection. It's something about you being isolated. That's what I'm getting off of this. Something about you even having a gullible mindset. It's something like these people feel like you ain't as smart as you are, ain't as tapped in as you are, but that's because they listening to this, possibly a Leo, a fire sign from your past. Okay, about you, like you come from the country, you don't know nothing, you ain't got no protection, ain't nobody looking out for you, or something like that. This Leo has put out there about you to this hyphen group and to this King of Swords. Mm, but I'm getting that this King of Swords and his attempt to disrupt your chi okay he has seen how the universe is going to ensure that you remain at peace he been on your tail for a while and initially he attempted to make you retreat but you remained in this bubble he could not disturb your chi and this man has become obsessed with you over time. Okay? So, you know, I don't know. I don't know. And whoever this is that's then rallied all these folks up against you, this person may feel like you moved on and reinvented yourself in your life with that new money you got and, got, and was cheating on them. Like, however you dipped out, however you switched up, they don't think that you just did that off no happenstance. Like, you may have already had somebody in the cut. But no, you wasn't cheating on this Leo. You didn't cheat on this Leo. You just made a new life for yourself. You manifested the life that you want, wanted, and it took you away from some sort of country living some sort of gullible life 
some sort something you were engaging in with this Leo wasn't right. Because if this person was correct, you wouldn't have left them behind. You wouldn't have created a new life away from them. Okay? Anything else from this Abinor Oracle deck? They dream, fa fantasize about you, but they also have nightmares about you. This King of Swords and this damn Leo Mac energy from your past. Both these men. Both of them now. And one of them want to use the other to punish you for being your true authentic self. And that's why they ain't getting away with nothing. Child, boo. I'm about to wrap this shit up. Because I get tired of picking up on this dumb shit. And it wouldn't be me. Let somebody sell me no wolf tickets. Wolf is the energy for tonight. Wouldn't be me. Let nobody push me up. To get my ass kicked by the universe. Because I'm messing with a divine being. Anything else. Yep, I'm about to close this. And I'm dropping the mic on that. Don't forget who really running this bitch, okay? Because it ain't this Hierophant group. It's not this Leo fire sign energy that's coming for this Pisces Merlin energy. And it's not this King of Swords. It's the Most High God. And the Most High God is trying to tell this hitman that he need to let that shit go for multiple reasons. And follow his intuition when it comes to this Divine Feminine. And I'm dropping the mic for real. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Take only what resonates. Leave the rest. And I'll be back soon with another one. Peace.